I don't know. They've only played in money matches, I guess. And I don't know how those went. Otherwise, this is their first time playing in tournament. And I know you say I'm like, I don't know. I, I feel like <laughs> you, you haven't. It's, it's weird because it's like the two best of their character, right? Yeah, so it's strange for them not to to, to meet up yeah, this no, far. Not, not that, but two best of their character and both play a character that they're the only ones that are like really good with, you know? Mm -hmm. So like they both don't have super experience in the matchup. You know what I mean? Well, let's see what they have in store for each other as we get oh, into game one on Smashville. This is already bad for Elliot. Wow. And he's gone. <laughs> yep. Good stuff to Isan for already showing how easy it is to edge guard Luigi. Oh my god. He almost is got he going back. for it again? He almost got... Oh, oh he missed the... He actually missed the... He, he actually... Elegant should have been dead. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Yeah. I wonder um, if this is... If this is how that money match went. I don't know. Hey, I mean, if it went anything like this, then uh, congratulations, Isam. Oh, good cyclone okay. time. Yeah, using the Cyclone to actually challenge Esam's um, edge guard. Yeah, we were kind of discussing um, <laughs> like how this matchup might go, and the main thing we did to say was Esam's not scared off stage, and that's what a lot of things that Elegant gets for most people. Is they're not sure how to edge guard him, or like even they're even scared to challenge him off stage. And Esam is just oh, that was a regrab. I don't know. Esam knows how to snipe jumps, and he also knows. Uh, that Cyclone has a lot of ending lag, so he's going to try to hit him every time like that. No wow, tech. Wow, no tech. Also, Esam is talking um, about SDI a lot. Should be able to SDI those. A lot of the, the Tornado that Elegant will be throwing at him. We did see Elegant try and do the down throw into the Tornado. Confirm. Yeah. Or the 50-50. The you can... Um, you can... DI the toward uh, the cyclone depending on where you hit off stage towards mm -hmm. the stage and then you can tech the last hit. You see how often boy, I wouldn't be surprised to see if he sees him at least once. Oh, first uh Elegant will have to get the cyclone off onto Esam. Yeah. It's rough too because uh oh oh that dare was so scary. Ooh, using the top part of Thunder. It, it's rough because uh Esam spacing his moves really well to where it's actually difficult for Elegant to get in. And you can't really abuse his punch game when you can't even really touch Pikachu. Then Ooh. you have this being sent off stage. Uh, <laughs> we take those. Oh, he, Elegant definitely takes those. And oh. Esam goes oh. solo once again. He oh. doesn't have his jump. Oh no! Oh, mistakes were made. <laughs> oh man! Oh no! <laughs> Just well. shrug it off, Esam. Going to game three. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, so misses his edge guard and dies for it. So basically, what's happening? Twice. <laughs> uh, Elegant now changing the timing that he does his recovery. He's delaying it slightly, so Esam does it early, and he avoids the hitbox. Then he, you know, punches him for it. So Esam actually can't go <laughs> preemptively off stage. Otherwise, Elegant's gonna, you know, avoid his, his edge guard attempts. <laughs> All right, nice catch there, though. Oh, crucial tech. Okay. I like Esam's use of uh, the Thunder Jolt to actually clash with not only pressure Elegant off stage, but if Elegant does opt to use the Luigi Missile to get a horizontal recovery, it actually stops it. Yeah, and then it forces him to uh, uh, Cyclone in a really bad spot. Yeah, it's forcing him to recover low. Oh, since so in the neutral there, but nice fighting back there from Esam. Pretty much always... Like, I think more so than most people, like, Esam always falls down with the hitbox before air dodging. Ooh, cross up there. Great tech from Elegant, otherwise he would have gotten destroyed. Double F smash coming out from Esam. He's trying to cover some space in case Elegant decides to approach. But a drag down fair into down tilt. Let's put a little bit of damage onto Elegant. Yeah, uh, PGU F smash is really safe, especially versus Ooh. Luigi. If he has the power shield. Uh, it goes down slightly, but Pikachu can make it back from that. Didn't get the last hit of the forward air, unfortunately, for uh, Esam. Ooh, another pivot up smash. Not going to be the stock, but still really good spacing. And here comes the edge guards again. Another crucial tech from Elegant. Yeah, he has to, because he's going to keep getting put in these spots where he has to tech just to live. He's in Tornado to challenge 
and get back on stage only to get F tilted right back off getting forced to recover low and those thunder jolts are just staying on the stage covering the ledge yeah look at this get up attack cancel the amount otherwise it would have been another off stage situation but elegant in a good spot here he's gonna go for it really interesting recovery nice stuff from Eason. Nice. Dab one, two into grab. And it's seeing an oh, up throw. Yeah, good DI mix up. Uh, it's also a kill throw, but Eason was DIing for the back throw regardless. So, mm -hmm. good stuff to Elliot. Uh oh. Grabbed. Okay. Good oh. DI on the throw. Yes. And cleans up the stock. Nice. And the taunt saying hello to the stream. Oh. But here we go. At the ledge. Should be big damage. Only 36%. Yeah. He still had good DI on the throw to avoid getting the down air spike. So you can only get weak dare to uh, forward air. Mm, but and still, this damage is adding up. Nice. 97%. That's looking really dangerous onto Esam. Oh, that forward air was so risky from Esam. Because if Elegant shielded, he could have got a beat again. Chasing with the tornado. Elegant going very high. Oh, nice down air again. Oh, catches the landing of the forward air. Oh, wow. He covered the mm. drift. Perfectly. Down throw Cyclone. Elegant up. 2-1. I don't know. Wow. Esam's edge guard is not looking so great that game. Well, he, was, he wasn't he was getting as many back airs as for the edge guards as he did in game one. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that's what I said. Elegant's changing the timing that you mm -hmm. choose to recover at. So, so for, he's forcing Esam so he, he can't pick that option. He has to use the Nair. Or maybe in the drag down forward air. Uh, he might. Oh, I was going to say he might be able to just opt for going th for the down airs too to catch the jump. All right, here we go. He's going to throw him off stage, going to town now. Oh, there's God, the no down air. Tech. That's all it takes. Okay. Damn. Zero he to has found his edge guard answer. Oh, got ahead of the jump. We got no double chopped. Oh, big hits here. More chops. Oh, he didn't get the profile from the platform. Otherwise, he could have got free grab. Okay. Nice coverage from Esam. But wow. Goes right into Luigi grab. Okay. Gets, oh, not safe. Oh, mm -hmm. man. He, I'm not sure if he missed the ledge or missed his uh, platform cancel, but otherwise, it doesn't matter. Elegant actually got the click. Is he dead? You cannot do that. You <laughs> just can't do that. You can't go that low against Elegant. <laughs> oh,